Well, Paul, you've, uh, you've sent home close on 7,000 people very happy. That was just a stunning performance. Yeah, yeah, we played well. We executed really well tonight. And uh, we wanted to get them on, on them early. And we did that. We had a great, th you know, great first period where we, we really did control the play. And uh, pretty much from there on in, you know, it was a, it was a comfortable win for us. But uh, good weekend, you know, to go in the NIC yesterday and win. You know, it's not an easy place to go. It isn't an easy place to go. And uh, we got a good win there. And then, then to follow it up with a, another stunning home performance like we put in tonight was, was very pleasing. You say stunning. And in that first period, some of the hockey that we played was sublime, wasn't it? Yeah, we, we work hard. I keep saying it, you know, we work hard every day and uh, we practice what you see out there. I mean, it doesn't just, it's not fairy dust that comes down and makes us do what we do and, you know, what the boys put in during the week, you know, and the, and the effort and commitment that they put in shows on the ice on, on the weekend and, and it did this weekend. So, uh, you know, outstanding weekend. I thought Dowdy was, was, was phenomenal. I thought that was his best weekend of the year. I thought he really did... Uh, Grab the game, both games by the scruff of the neck, and Ratchuk get two goals, two big goals. Davy Phillips gets a beautiful one timer tonight, and uh, you know we, we spread the points round, and uh, other guys step up and do the job. But you know, to the man, I thought everybody was excellent. That Davy Phillips goal kind of summed up the whole night. The build up was outstanding. Nottingham were chasing, and then the finish was was just exquisite. Yeah, yeah, it was. We you know we had one breakdown on their goal where we, you know we didn't read it right in our trap, but. Uh, they executed well for that, but I mean, it could have, you know, yeah, I'm, I'm overjoyed that we won 6-1 against our, you know, local rivals, but it could have been a few more as well. We missed a couple of backdoor empty nets, and I think we hit four posts tonight. So I think that tells you the dominance that we had, you know, for the 60 minutes. That's one of our games in hand, if you like, against the Cardiff Devils. Huge weekend next weekend, uh, on the road and, and away from this building. But you can't have a better preparation for that weekend than what you've gone through in the last 24 hours. No, we got a, we'll, have a, we'll have a tough weekend coming up. But we know, David, we, we're not looking at, at where Cardiff are and how many games in hand. We, we know what we've got to do. It's, it's not a sprint, this thing. I know it's an old cliche. It's a marathon. And uh, we've got to chip away, chip away. If we want to get to the top of the mountain, we've got to chip away and climb and climb and climb and climb and worry about us. And uh, we've got another big weekend. There's a lot of hockey to play this season, but we're going the right way. And I'm enjoying, you know, working with this group and, and with, with Jerry and, because every day we test each other and, uh, you know, the results are showing that. So it's, uh, you know, Belfast are a tough team. They're a good team. They're a highly skilled team. That's going to be a tough game. And then to have back-to-back -back away games with travel on both of them, and playing flights on both of them, it's, uh, it's going to you know, be a big test for us. Just one final thing, just at the end of the night, we, we mentioned Jonathan Phillips' testimonial on Tuesday. He got an amazing reception there. He's so well thought of in the fan base, but even more so, I think, in the, in the core group of, of guys here. Just, just explain briefly to us what, what it means to you to have a captain like him and, and what he does bring to that dressing room. He's just a, he's just a class individual. He's a class person, and, he, you know, and he's... Uh, he gives me everything he has every single night, and you know, and he's the glue. He's the glue in that room, and uh, and I said, I just said to him, you know, this is Jono's week this week, and uh, you know, you've got some old friends flying back in. You know, I saw Munner, and it was good to see Leggy back again, and and Talbot. I mean, he used to give me heart attack. It was I like looking at them three on the ice today, thinking, thank God they've finished. You know, uh, from my days in Coventry. But I said to Jono, enjoy this week because it's actually a celebration of your career and your career for. For your club, you know, this is his club. And uh, sometimes you don't take it in. And I remember someone saying that to me in my testimonial about 100 years ago. They said, just relax and enjoy it. And understand everybody's here for you and to support you. And, uh, and I really do hope he, he takes it in because he's had a fabulous career. He's had a fabulous career here and he'll continue to do that because he's a, he's a great captain, leader and person.